It's summertime. It's the beginning of summer. It's June. Gas prices are insane, super high, record breaking. Everybody's crying. But one thing you don't have to cry about, one thing that you can keep to you is to smell great. So no matter where your adventures take you, no matter where you go on the weekend, you can smell great. No matter where your adventures take you, smell great going there. You may have a bunch of go-to summer fragrances. Usually most people who are into the fragrance game have really good summer go-to fragrances because usually people go out more in the summer, so they're more likely to buy citrusy, summer, warm, scented fragrances that are mass pleasing to most everybody. But if you're looking for something a little more sophisticated, now this fragrance is sophisticated, it's a niche fragrance, it's expensive, and that is Greenly by Parfums de Marly. Can you see that? Greenly by Parfums de Marly. If you're not familiar with PDM, they are a niche house that mainly deals in fragrances based out of France. All the names of their fragrances are apparently named after King Louis the 15th racehorses. I don't know how true that is. I don't race horses. So I don't know, King Louis had either a gambling problem or you know, PDM wanted to make a profit on that and be sophisticated and fancy. But what I can tell you is that these smell amazing. All of Parfum de Marly's fragrances are amazing. Everyone I smell this high quality, Greenly. Now I don't know if that's a good name for a horse, but it's a good name for a green fragrance. Greenly is a very citrus and aromatic fragrance. It's bursting with green apple, green tart apple. It's a little bit sweet, but I mean, this is a green apple bomb. This is a citrusy, potent green apple smell. This leans very masculine, even though it is labeled as unisex, but it's very masculine. It's very sophisticated. This is a fancy fragrance. This is some James Bond shit right here. If James Bond went to a summer ball, this is what he's gonna wear. True luxury at its finest, the notes are as followed. Green apple, bergamot, orange, pedigree, cashmere, and primrose seed of violet, followed by the dry down of oak moss, musk, and amber wood. Oh, no, no, no. As soon as you spray this, you get hit with tart green apple. It gets very woody from there with cedar, and there's a little bit of warmth to this. Um, it's a tad musky, but it's very uh, manly, sophisticated musk. So it's green, citrus, fresh, woody, and a little bit warm and musky from like cashmere. So it's like a cozy, comforting vibe to this. This is very, very, very luxury. This is luxury as shit to its finest. I'm not gonna lie. You can say what you want about the racehorses. You can say what you want about the gimmicks but this is pure luxury. This is fragrances to the highest, finest caliber. You cannot like apple. Some people think it smells like shampoo. It's not it. There, there's, no, there's no soapy shampoo vibe in this, not at all. It's just because it's green apple and you don't smell green apple in much variety of different fragrances other than candies and soaps or shampoos. This is neither. This is a class of its own. This is worthy of fucking Louis the 15th to wear this, the King of France, wherever he was from. I'm not gonna lie, he was probably crushing all the handmaidens back then. This will definitely make you feel top dog like a king for sure. Where would I wear this? This is sophisticated and luxury, like I said. I would wear this to a wedding. You would outshow anybody there. I would wear this to like a ball, anywhere you have to go fancy. A banquet, you know, a gang fight after midnight. Some, if you want a battle rap on a, you know, bridge over an expressway, you wear this. Uh, this is super sophisticated. I, you could wear this everyday use, honestly. If you really just want to ball out and stand out, everyday wear is perfect. But me personally, I save this for sophisticated special events. If you're looking to impress, if you're going out for the night, you want to wear this. Oh, this smells so good. Let's give this bad boy a spray, shall we? Let's see the spritz here. Atomizer is good, comes out really smooth. Smells so good. This is beast mode longevity. This is beast mode projection. All you need with this, honestly, is one spray. I would do one spray, two max, and you're gonna be clearing rooms. Everyone's gonna smell you. You smell fresh and clean, sophisticated. You smell like you're worth a million dollars, honestly. Let's do one more spray here. 
Now I would buy this at Lucky Scent. These are expensive for a 75 ml. This is gonna run you about $270 roughly. This is the 125 ml and this one's about $315. I know that's a lot of money. You can get samples if you want. You can, or I would order a sample of anything, honestly, that's expensive so you can test it. But I mean, let's, let's be honest, a bottle like this is gonna last you for the rest of your life. There is no way if you have a few bottles in your collection that you're completely gonna drain this. It's not gonna happen. It'll never happen. And if it does, well, you're probably like Louis the 15 and you deserve to be betting on horses or owning your own. I own about 27 race horses myself. What kind of badass would wear something like this? Well, clearly kings would wear this, actors would wear this. This is something that a high class celebrity would wear. Somebody that I would expect to wear this, this is the vibe. This is James Bond at a summer party, he's wearing this. If anyone's watched the show Ozark, this is something you wear when you go on the casino boat with the fancy politician party and you're trying to push your crooked laws in, this is what you wear. This is top level assassin shit here, right? You don't see them, but you smell them. And I don't know why, but for some reason, I feel like Gordon Ramsay would wear this. And if he's not wearing this, well, Gordon, you need to wear this. At least check it out and then say that I told you. Once again, this is Greenlee by Parfums de Marly. Check this one out. I'm telling you, for summer, this is unique as shit. You're gonna stand out. This is luxury. This is a once in a lifetime fragrance. Check it out, you'll love it. I'm, I'm not gonna lie, you'll love it. This is the Fragrance Channel. Thanks for stopping by.